The European Commission takes note of today's ruling of the European Court of Justice on the interpretation of the underlying rules concerning indication of origin. Clear and non-misleading indication of origin is an essential part of the EU's consumer policy. The Court's decision confirms, as said in the Commission's interpretative notice of 2015, that the indication of origin of the products originating in Israeli settlements must be correct and not misleading to the consumer. The EU's position regarding this issue has not changed. The control and enforcement of the correct implementation of EU rules regarding the indication of origin is the task of the member states. The court ruling does not concern products from Israel itself. As you know, Israel has a privileged trading relationship with the European Union based on uh, the EU-Israel Association Agreement, establishing that products originating uh, in Israel within its internationally recognized borders benefit from preferential tariff treatment upon their entry into the European Union. This situation will remain unchanged. The EU has a long-standing and well-known position that it will not recognize any changes to the pre-1967 Israeli borders other than those agreed by the parties to the Israeli-Palestinian conflict. The EU considers settlements in occupied territories illegal under international law. The EU and Israel are very close partners and bilateral relations cover a wide number of important areas. The EU remains committed to working with Israel on a mutually beneficial relationship within the framework of the existing action plan. The EU reiterates its fundamental commitment to the security of Israel. The EU does not support any form of boycott or sanctions against Israel. And the EU rejects attempts by the campaigns of the so-called boycott divestment sanctions movement to isolate Israel.